Sweet potatoes aren't just a healthier alternative to white potatoes. They're a superfood that you can enjoy daily as a filling snack that helps burn belly fat. But you shouldn't make any of these three common mistakes, as they could have detrimental effects on any low-calorie diet for weight loss. Above all, sweet potatoes are low in calories. Baked or boiled sweet potatoes have up to 90 calories per 100 grams. Practically, a medium, cooked sweet potato has about 115 calories. But you should avoid eating deep-fried sweet potatoes or potato chips as they have substantially more calories. Deep-fried sweet potatoes have more than twice the calorie content of the other cooking methods, as vegetable oils are among the most calorie-dense foods you can eat. Just a tablespoon has about 125 calories. Commercial potato chips have even more calories. Just a small package may have more than 180 calories. My favorite way to eat sweet potatoes is by air frying them. Their crunchiness supports the feeling of fullness. More importantly, air fried sweet potatoes are similar in calories to baked ones. Moreover, sweet potatoes are good for weight loss because they're rich in fiber. Baked sweet potatoes have 3.3 grams of fiber. A serving provides almost 30% of the daily value. Air fried sweet potatoes have up to 72% more fiber though. Hence, they could be a super filling snack. High fiber intake has been linked to a reduced risk of obesity. Prefer to consume sweet potatoes with the skin on, as it is the most fiber-rich part. Due to their high fiber content, sweet potatoes don't spike blood sugar levels besides being high in carbs. They have a medium glycemic load close to 19. Foods with low glycemic load are good for weight control. Also, it's important to combine sweet potatoes with a low-fat, low-calorie dip. You could prepare dips with healthy foods rich in protein, vitamins, and antioxidants, including Greek yogurt, herbs, tahini, or avocado. Keep in mind that most commercial dips aren't suitable for a weight loss diet, as they're packed with calories. Actually, it's important to eat meals both high in fiber and protein for weight loss. The combination of these macronutrients plays a huge role in satiety. So, you could try cooking sweet potatoes with lean protein sources, such as chicken, turkey, salmon, eggs, Greek yogurt, or cottage cheese. Even vegan dishes with beans, vegetables, chia seeds, tofu, or tempeh help build a lean body. As a general guideline, a serving size of sweet potatoes is typically considered to be around half a cup to one cup, depending on the cooking method. You can eat a cup of baked, boiled or air-fried sweet potatoes a day as part of a healthy, balanced diet. Try to consume no more than half a cup of deep-fried sweet potatoes though. You should be very cautious with the portion size of chips as well. Limit the portion size to less than half a cup to control calorie intake. Consume them only occasionally. Eating significantly higher amounts could ruin your weight loss efforts. Balance and moderation should be the key to any diet plan. Both white and sweet potatoes can be a part of a healthy, well-balanced diet for weight loss. However, sweet potatoes are a much healthier food option because they're particularly rich in carotenoids. They contain more beta-carotene even than carrots. Carotenoids are beneficial for preserving a healthy body weight. They regulate the formation of body fat tissue. In any case, you can eat French fries while dieting. They could also help you follow a low-calorie diet for a long time, as they're the favorite comfort food for most people.